alongside veteran reliever Joe Smith. Well, it was short and sweet, I think it, you might put it. Uh, the Blue Jays now finalizing a move, Joe, to send you to uh, Cleveland. Uh, your thoughts and your reaction? Um, well, I think, you know, just with the way the season has gone, and it's one of those things that happens when the business side gets in. And I mean, obviously, I didn't expect this sign in here. Um, with this team that have been back to back to ALCSs to go this route. You know, the whole kind of point of signing here was to be on a postseason uh, team where you don't have to get traded in the middle of the year. But, you know, things happen, and no matter where you're at, you never know what's going to happen. That's why we play the game. But, um, you know, I loved my time here in Toronto. Ross and Mark, obviously, are unbelievable coaching staff. We, I mean, Gibby and Pete, just, and the guys here. I mean, I've had a lot of fun. Um, you know, and then obviously from the other side, the training staff and the strength coaches, the high performance. I mean, they were, I worked a lot with them over <laughs> spring training just to get my body back to, you know, having fun and playing the game when I, that I could, you know, the way I know I can. And uh, the past two years have been a grind as far as health issues and just not performing. And uh, to be, come over here and, and get the attention and, and uh, the care that they give, and they, you know, they treated me like family. <laughs> and um, you know, I, I can't thank them enough. I love the city of Toronto. You know, me and my wife, we went up there, didn't know what to expect going to another country. And um, but it's awesome, man, the support from the fans and just you know living in Toronto, and it's it's unbelievable. Um, you know, on the flip side, I get to go home. You know, that's where. So. Cleveland is home for you. You told me earlier off camera that uh, you knew your name was out there as a pending free agent. You heard the rumors. You heard all the talk. Had it been weighing on you in these last few days leading up to today? Uh, well, kind of, kind of not. I mean, I kind of put my phone away. There's some people that haven't gotten texts in, a long, in a few, about the past week just because, you know, they, they're doing things. You know, they're texting you and saying, oh, I heard this, I heard this. And, you know, all, you're, all I'm trying to do is get healthy and throw the ball like I can, like I was before I went on the DL. So. I had my mind trying to focus on that, which kind of took some of the distraction away. But uh, today was a kind of a struggle, you know, wondering uh, come three o'clock central time if I was still going to be here and, and we're going with this or I'm going somewhere else. But, um, you know, obviously there's a lot off my mind now. You're going home. That's got to be uh, that's got to be pretty exciting for you. And you're going to a contender. Yeah. What are your thoughts on that? I mean, that's why we play, you know, that, like, like I said, that's why I signed over here. I thought we had a chance to win and unfortunately injuries struck us just about everywhere. And, um, you know, not saying that they're out of it right now, you know, they're going to keep fighting these guys, but obviously going over to Cleveland, um, got to watch them pretty close last year and uh, they got a great team and, and they're doing it again this year. They're just now looks like they're hitting their stride and playing some good baseball and, um, it's going to be a fun time over there. All right. Parting words for Blue Jays fans from Joe Smith. <laughs> I don't know. Thank you, guys. Uh, appreciate all the support. Love the city. Who knows what will happen? Maybe I'll be back. All right. Joe, uh, good luck to you. Good luck to Allie, your family, your foundation. It was uh, great covering you in this short time. We wish you the best of health throughout the season. Thanks, Hazel.